Yo, what's going on guys, welcome back to our channel and today I'm gonna show you how you can unlock everything in Need for Speed Unbound and when I mean everything, I mean all the custom cars for which you would have to buy all the DLCs all the regular cars for which you would have to do all the stupid challenges and everything else so without further ado, let's jump straight into this video for this to work, we will have to use a mod, and because we are using mods, we will have to install Frosty Mod Manager. I found a stable version of Frosty Mod Manager on the Slide Windows Discord channel, for which I will leave the link down in the description below. Now this Frosty Mod Manager was made after the Volume 3 update for Need for Speed Unbound, but it's still working after the Volume 5 update and will probably still work after the updates that are still yet to come. So to download this mod manager just click on this download button, I will uh, leave this link in the description as well. Click on download anyway. Now open up the zip folder and extract Frosty Mod Manager somewhere on your computer. I will extract mine somewhere on my H drive. Now when the mod manager is successfully extracted, open up the folder and launch frostymodmanager.exe. Now just to mention it, for this tutorial I completely uninstalled Need for Speed Unbound and reinstalled it, so if you face any errors in the Frosty Mod Manager, I advise you to first reinstall Need for Speed Unbound and then try again. Now when we first launch Frosty Mod Manager, we will have to select our game, which is of course Need for Speed Unbound, and click on select. Now I'm happy that we encountered this error. The SDK profile for Need for Speed Unbound is out of date because I've seen a lot of you people asking me what to do now uh, because it says that uh, please launch the game uh, through Origin but we all know that Origin doesn't exist anymore so what to do now? Just click on Next and launch the game through EA app or Steam wherever you have it installed. So yeah, just launch your Need for Speed Unbound and now this process will become active you can already see and now we have to wait that all of these steps are done so yeah just go into your game and wait for for all those steps to be done now when the SDK was successfully created you can click on finish this will close your frosty mod manager and you can go back to your Nisus Speed Unbound and exit the game now you want to again go to your Frosty Mod Manager folder and launch Frosty Mod Manager EXE. Again select Need for Speed Unbound and click on Select. And just like that our Frosty Mod Manager is ready to be used. Now we just need to find a mod which will help us unlock all the cars. For this you will go to the Nexus Mods page for which I will leave the link down in the description as well and find Unbound Remix Mod. Uh, yeah, this mod you can you can read everything this mod does to your game. Uh, it would basically unlock all the custom cars for which we would otherwise have to uh, pay to get the DLCs. So click on manual and download. And slow download because we don't have premium account. Once the Unbound Trimming mod was downloaded, open up the zip file. Go into the Unbound Remix folder, mod folder, and here we have Unbound Remix .fbpack mod. Since this is fbpack mod, uh, we will just drag and drop this file to our Frosty Mod Manager. Pack has been successfully imported. Click on OK, and now here we have our Unbound Remix and Unbound Remix Part Two mod, and which we select and just like that we just click on launch to launch our Need for Speed Unbound. Now this mod will work for both story and online but just for the sake of time of this video I will just show you the online and we can already see that the mod is working because of the changed loading screen which has Unbound Remix and now if we go into the rights and buy and sell and under custom vehicles we can see that we have a bunch of new vehicles we have this uh, Volkswagen Beetle uh, which is part of the one of the DLCs uh, I don't know, just a bunch of cars uh, so yeah, but some of the cars, for example 
these ones are still locked because uh, we would have to do some challenges and if we go to buy stock uh, there are still some cars that are locked for us so for that for these cars to be unlocked uh, we will use a cheat engine script uh, you can go to cheat engine website and download the latest cheat engine but I already have one so I won't do that uh, so the script you will be using is this need for speed unbound to unlock everything cheat engine script so you just double click it and then you first need to select the process click on this select process and find need for speed unbound and click on open and keep the current address list code yes and then just click on activate this unlock everything now the script is active you can go back to your need for speed unbound and go back to buy and sell maybe for the first time the game will uh, start lagging for a couple of seconds but then it will be fine uh, and yeah we can see that we have all the cars unlocked now even those for which we need to do the stupid challenges and yeah just like that we have unlocked all the cars in it for speed unbound including all the all the driving effects samples everything so yeah guys it's just that simple with frosty by manager and one cheat engine script we can get all the cars uh, for which we would otherwise have to pay or do the challenges so yeah now let me just match make so we will see that the cars actually work and yeah just like that you see we have a brand new Corvette C7 which is part of the custom cars category and yeah with all that said I will end the video here if you enjoyed it please drop the like button and consider subscribing if you haven't yet and as always have a great day and I will see you in the next one